Today we'll be working with multiplying two-digit by two-digit numbers um, within word problems. Um, on our scale of one to four, we hope to be at about a three. Um, our learning goal, we hope to be able to illustrate and explain multiplication calculations of two-digit by two-digit problems using equations, rectangular arrays, and area models. Um, it's important when working with word problems that we remember cubed. Um, C, circle the numbers. U, underline the question. B, box your keywords. E, eliminate any extra information. And of course, D, ask yourself, does your answer make sense? This is a good time to pause and write this in your notes. Let's do the first problem together. Adam's mother had 24 photo albums with 72 pictures in each album. How many pictures did his mother have in total? So let's go ahead and circle the numbers. Next, let's underline the question. How many pictures did his mother have total? Then we're going to go ahead and box our keywords. We know that we're working with photo albums and pictures within each of those albums. Um, there isn't any extra information that we need to eliminate, so let's go ahead and solve. We are doing 24 times 72. Remember, first, we do our 1s times our 1s, which gives us 8. We do our 1s times our 10s, which gives us 4. We remember to drop our 0. We do our 10s times our 1s, which gives us 28. Carrying the 2, drop the 8. And then 7 times 2 is 14. Adding the 2 gives us 16. Then when we add, we are left with 1,728. Next, Reed was unpacking boxes of ornaments. If he has 59 boxes with 84 ornaments in each box, how many ornaments does he have all together? If you want to know how many ornaments he has all together, we don't need to know that he was unpacking boxes of ornaments to help us solve the problem. And we know we're trying to figure out just how many ornaments are in each box. So we are left with 84 times 59. Remember, 1 times the 1, leaving us with 36, carry the 3, drop the 6, 9 times 8 is 72, add the 3, giving us 75. Remember to drop your 0. Cross out what we already used. 5 times 4 is 20, carry your 2, drop your 0, 5 times 8 is 40. Remember to add your 2 and then add up your 2 partial products, leaving you with 4,956. Let's do one last one together. A toy store sold 52 video games in one day. If each game cost $71, how much money did they make? You know, we want to find out how much money they made. We know that we are trying to figure out the amount of dollars. So we are going to do 52 times 71. Remember, 1 times the 1. It gives you 2, 1 times your 10 spot, 1 times 5 gives you 5. Drop your 0, 7 times 2 is 14. Make sure you carry your 1 and drop your 4. And then 7 times 5 leaves you with 35. Plus the 1 gives you 36. When you add your partial products together, you are left with 3,662. Let's try these next three problems on your own. This one as well, and lastly this one. Take a look at your learning goal to make sure that we are where we should be. Have a great night.